Hey, what's up, guys? I've got a really cool unboxing for you. It is Saturday. Um, so I almost said December. It's not December yet. Jesus. Uh, September 22nd. And I got this in the mail today. This actually was shipped yesterday. So this is the first time in forever that I've gotten a steelbook from Best Buy this early. As far as I know, anyway. And um, I am very, very hopeful there's no dents on here because that would be annoying to have to wait a couple days to do that. So let's open this up. I have not seen this film yet. I heard mixed things about it. Like, when it first came out, I heard that it was not good or something. I this, is the, this is the film that had um, the directors from Lego film, and then they were kind of fired for whatever reason. I'm not really sure. Creative differences, budgetary reasons. And then Ron Howard was uh, came in re and replaced them and finished the film. I don't know how much of the film was finished at that point and how much Ron Howard did and edited and all that shit, but... Um, that was a debacle, apparently. Um, I heard after it was released and after some time had gone away, I think people liked it a little bit more. But um, I was never really that interested in a, in a solo film to begin with, honestly. But it's just part of the Star Wars legacy or whatever now, and I figured the saga series. I wanted to see it. I wanted to see more of the characters and stuff. I want to see who um, uh, Amelia Clark is playing. Actually, I have no idea what her name is. And then seeing... Um, um, what's his name? God damn it. I'm not going to remember his name. Donald Glover, that's his name. As, um, Lando. It's pretty cool. The Steelbook looks good. I really wish they would get back to putting the titles on here. It's annoying. But, um, this is okay, I guess. Um, the Millennium Falcon. I feel like actually looking at it now, the image, it seems kind of... Um, I'm trying to say it's not clear. I don't know. Um, it's very glossy. It's the first glossy steelbook I've gotten. Is it glossy actually? Yeah, it's glossy. I feel like it's the first glossy steelbook I've gotten in a while. Let me open it up here. Here's my code. It was anywhere, blah, blah, blah. <coughs> Excuse me. And I got the Blu-ray. Oh, fuck. Blu-ray on the left, the 4K on the right, and then the bonus Blu-ray features on the back there. Let's get this out of here. And there's the cockpit. As she said. That's pretty cool. I'm, I'm curious to check it out. I've heard that there's some good um, um, Chewbacca scenes in here. Or something. Wait, hold on. Wait. What am I doing? I'm going to put this... Put this disc back here because I don't care about that so much. I'll put the bonus in front of this. Actually, maybe I'll do this. Put the disc over here and put the bonus on the other side. That's what I'll do. There. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy. Oh. There we go. See, I got this earlier than I usually get them. And I don't usually get them early, so that's probably why. What else is in this? Elden Iron Iron Reich. That's the guy who plays um, Young Han. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. This is cool. I'm going to watch this tonight, hopefully. And um, I'm assuming anyone who's buying this is going to get it next week. And let me know which versions you got. I know there's a Target exclusive, I think. I think there is. But I went with the Steelbook because, of course, I collect Steelbooks. So anyway, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you around. Uh, bye.